If you want to learn how to add, remove, or disable languages in your Lyra base game, then this is the video for you. Let's navigate to the Lyra front end map. And from there, let's play. And in the Lyra game, you can go to options and you can change your languages under the gameplay tab. You'll notice that it has specific languages and I'll just show you where that's set up and how to add some and how to remove some. And then navigate to tools and then localization dashboard. So this is your dashboard for pretty much all your game's localization. And the languages that you saw in that list, they're taken from the game's uh, localized languages. So go ahead and scroll all the way down to your cultures section. And what I noticed at first when I opened this project is that French was missing. And I, I do speak French. It is my native tongue. Um, so what I did is I went ahead and just clicked on compile translations for this culture. So I'll do the same thing, but for Spanish. I don't really know much of much Spanish, uh, but it'll be a good test just to see a language show up on the list. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and compile Spanish. So this button, Lara seems to come with a lot of translations with all these languages, which is really generous of them and awesome. And then under edit, project settings, Navigate to the packaging tab under the project section. And then in the packaging section, you can click on the advanced just to expand the advanced section. And then you can click on show localized and this will show everything, every language that's been compiled and has been localized. So let's scroll down and let's try to find Spanish. Okay, sweet. So uh, Spanish now shows up and it's on. And before I compiled it, it didn't use to show up in the show localized. Um, so maybe this is just because it's a fresh Lyra install and I updated it. I know my old one used to have all pretty much all the languages in that list enabled already. Um, yeah, so this um, this whole section if you don't have it selected, it won't show up or it won't be packaged in your game. Um, and another thing to note is that uh, depending on which languages you plan to support, you can just make sure that that data is uh, limited or smaller. Um, so if you choose just English, then it'll just be English. Um, the one I will probably end up using is the English, French, Italian, German, Spanish one, uh, because I am fluent with French. And then there's one with uh, even more. Another point I wanted to make with localization that's really awesome is let me just minimize everything and let's play. Uh, oh, yeah, another tool I would like to mention is the widget reflector. So whenever you're curious about where a widget is, um, you can open up this widget reflector and then you can pick a hit testable widget or you can pick a painted widget if, it, if it's a widget that doesn't get any hits. Uh, so in our case, it would be like this, this border. Um, uh, you could press escape to stop capturing. So I'll, I'll just keep it with the hit testable one, which I think everything is hit testable. Um, so I'm just going to uh, pick this widget here and then escape. And then you'll see that it actually shows up Lyra front end in the list. And so here's our widget for our main menu. And a great thing with localization after you compile the language is you can actually preview what it would look like in that widget itself. So if your screen is pretty small, 
you'll notice that it's very spazzy. So just make sure to really give give yourself a lot of space here. And yeah, so now I can actually choose French and see what it would look like. And any other languages, I could turn off that feature. So yeah, if you want to omit some languages from your package build, you can just make sure to not have it be part of the packaging supported languages. So localizations to package. Okay, so let's say for this build, I don't actually want, a, let's say Korean. I, it's hard to pick a, a language. Yeah, so if I make a, a package build, so I'm just going to package this project and yeah, just go and call it settings UI without Korean. Select the folder. I'm running the package build. And when we go to options, gameplay, you'll notice that Korean is not one of the options. So this is how you kind of, you can disable some languages in a package game, uh, but still keep it open for the future and not straight up delete all the translations that already come uh, predefined in Lara. Thanks for watching.